Hello everybody, it's the real Mr. Squid here. Welcome back to another episode of Self-Taught Building. Hope y'all are having a good day. I'm having a good day. So, I thought I'd come up here and show you guys this real quick. Uh, it's a little thing I found. I thought it was pretty funny. Cause sometimes I like to go through the, like, the world and kind of like examine my build and see where I can improve. You know, it's an important part of building. And I was coming up here to look at this, and I came in here, and I was like, what is up with all these rabbits? These rabbits have they've invaded the home. This is their home now. And I found out the funny reasoning behind that. I did not spawn any of these rabbits in, by the way. Um, and that's what's so funny about it is because there's so many. And the reason behind that is, I think they're the actually uh, I think they're actually the only thing spawning in this entire world. You see, rabbits can only spawn on probably like grass and dirt blocks, and these are the only grass or dirt blocks in the entire world. And these are all desert rabbits, and this is a desert, and there's just so many of them in this small area. Anyway, I thought I'd show you guys that. I thought it was pretty cool. So, what are we really messing with today? Today, I thought we'd get back into the heart of the series and just, you know, get a random thing to build and just build it on the spot. So, let's see what we get. A greenhouse. Like an, okay, a nursery. Yep, greenhouse nursery thing. Little plant nursery. I think we can mess with that. So, I know they're mostly glass for the most part, and they're never like clear glass. You guys ever see, like, the clear glass ones? They're never, they're always, like, a, like a kind of a foggy type of glass. I wonder if that has something to do with, like, the greenhouse effect. I don't know. But that is what we'll be messing with today. And they're always, like, made out of some, like, metal, like a thin frame or something of, like, what appears to be aluminum, and then the rest of it's, like, a special glass. I don't know. So let's see. Maybe walls would be good for that. Andesite or cobblestone or something. Not quite sure. Oh, we can use the new moss block. Okay, I'll definitely try to implement that somehow. I gotta remember. Definitely gotta remember that. Okay, so... Okay, I think I, I, think I have an idea in mind. So, let's see. Let's go this way. Start with the corner, I guess. Yeah, I do like the andesite. Let's get rid of the cobblestone. Take this up three. That does look like the side of a greenhouse. Maybe, maybe I should make the glass thicker. Mm. Like, do I need the center one? I do like the center one, but you know what I'll do? I'll do this. I will make this that much longer, I think, right? And then if I put it in the middle, it should look good. One more longer. Into the center of it. There we go. That's nice. That looks better. Okay, we'll hit up the back, which will be not as, um, definitely not as long. What do we got? Like, is that five? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, five. So we'll do like four. And then one center. And then we'll do four again. Let's see. Uh, that seems a little big. We'll knock it down to three. That looks better. Nice little cute little greenhouse. Okay. We'll match it symmetrically over here. I think the roof is probably going to be the hardest part. Or maybe the easiest part. I'm not sure. But I am excited to do the interior. Especially with all the new like moss blocks and azalea flowers and stuff like that. Okay. So... Okay, cool. Bring this up. And we will bring this across, probably. I'm trying to think if I want to go up more than one. Definitely got to bring it to the face, I'm thinking. But do we do this? Do we do something like that? Mm, we'll see afterwards. We'll get the glass in first, and then we'll see. Cause that looked kind of weird. I'm not gonna lie. Um, maybe over, and then maybe over one more than up. Yeah, 
Yeah, yeah, that'll be good. And then we should be able to connect them, I'm thinking. Yeah, it's not bad. I mean, it's simple. It's it's definitely it's definitely very simple. Um <clears throat> And the question comes in on whether or not we just do this. I mean, that is kind of greenhousey. That doesn't look right. I feel like if we add this, it'll be too pointy and it'll look kind of weird. Uh, we'll stay without this for now. Okay, so how do we implement? Do we just do that? That. I like that. That looks better. I know it's a lot of glass, but that's just, just the way it goes. We could bring this up potentially. And then we could even knock out the, let's see, let's see what this looks like. I feel like this is not gonna look good. Um yeah, no, let's 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 bring this back to glass. That looked pretty weird, pretty weird. Um okay. So should we do something for this? Should we fix this somehow? I guess that's still supporting it, but it's not really keeping much together. Maybe like this should go around the outside. Cause like I want there to be more supports visually. I just don't know how to implement it. That looks pretty good actually. Let's see, can we do that on can we do that on the back as well? That looks pretty good. And that might make this look better. Oh yeah, it does. Okay. Okay. Very cool. Very cool. I like this. I like this a lot. Um, yeah, I like this a lot. Okay. So, let's mess around with the inside. They're normally like concrete. Just just nice paved concrete. So, let's get that going. Let's knock this all out. There's normally a grate in the middle for like liquid, like like water. Uh, I'm gonna try to add something up top to water the plants. I'm not sure what that's gonna be. Get all this knocked out just real quick. Okay, there we go. It's okay, this place will really come alive once we get all the shrubbery inside of it. I'm thinking. I'm hoping. <laughs> okay, let's get that grate going now. Um, trap door. Most people do this as a grate. Well, let's also try iron iron bars. Yeah, it looks kind of weird. Not not super appealing. That looks a lot better. Does it matter which way we place these? I don't think it does. Get a water bucket or something. Oh goodness, I've made a grave mistake. Yeah, there we go. That should get rid of it. Nice. Okay, now we have a drain that's dang near overflowing with water. <laughs> As a drain does. Uh, what type of door should we use? I feel like just... Uh... I don't know. I wish there was like a glass door. 
Uh, oh, a spyglass. I did not see that before. Let's mess around with this for a second, just for a quick second. I heard a lot of people were hating on this thing. I mean, it's got a nice texture. And you, what do you do? You just right-click to use it? Oh, that's a super nice zoom-in. And it's like a hold. It's quick. I think a lot of the hate came from people that used Optify, and I don't know. Just because they just like to press control, and it's a better zoom. But this is very nice. Look at that. You can see that iron ore? Glowstone? Where is... Where, you know, like, where's the things? It's useful. You can find out where things are real quick. Okay. Did I put water in all these? It looks like one's missing. Oh, we're good there. Door. We'll stick with oak for now, but I'm not loving that. I might switch to iron. That looks just, that looks so wrong. Maybe a gate? Yeah, we'll keep a gate for now. I just, I don't know. I don't know what we're going to do. Okay, so... We're going to need some flower pots. We're going to need some... Mm. Dark oak. I'm thinking. Thinking some dark oak stairs. All right, let's do spruce. Spruce stairs. Along with slabs. Okay, get something like this going. Okay, that's a nice table for some flowers. Uh, we'll get like a super long one going here. Or maybe like a super short one, actually. Okay. Azalea. So this cannot be put it inside here. Oh, it can! Oh my goodness! That is adorable, because I don't know if you guys know, this thing is huge. So they shrunk down this huge plant and just put it... <laughs> that is actually, that's pretty funny. I'm not going to lie to you. Okay, so we're going to get a bunch of potted plants here. Now things are going to get colorful real quick. So we'll have, what, maybe a couple of these in here. Have two and two. We'll have two of one and two of another. I don't know, like, I'm not a. I don't have a green thumb, so to speak, so I don't know in what arrangement plants would be put in. I don't think they'd put it like one plant, a different plant, and then the first plant again. Like, I don't think they'd go uh, trade off, you know, this plant, that plant, this plant, that plant. I'd, they'd probably put them in bunches, if I had to guess. But, you know, I'm not a botanist or anything of the sort. So, let's see what we can get going here. Some nice alliums. Okay, what else? What else can we get going here? I don't think... Can you put sugar cane in? I didn't think that you could. Actually, I did, I did think that you could. I thought you could. Maybe you can't. So you can do bamboo. Can't do small drip leaf. It's fun to see what you can do. Um, oh, there was chains. Would have chains been but No. No, they would not. No, they would not have. I was going to say, dang it, man. Just found out. Just remembered about chains. It's got some bamboo. I don't think bamboo's the wave here. I think we need more vibrant colors, like uh, red tulips. I'm trying to think of like flowers people actually go and buy. Uh, tulip, sunflower? People, okay. So you can't, so we're going to have to put some of the tall flowers in the actual ground. So we're going to have to mess with that after. Um, let's get something nice and short here. Azure Bluette. Okay, that's looking pretty good. Moss, how do we implement you? Should I do the carpet? I don't know how it works with grass either. Okay. But now can you grow things on this moss? No, you cannot. Okay. That's fine.
Oh, that's cool. Put a couple of those around. Some spore blossoms. We got things growing from the ceiling. Vines going from the ceiling, maybe? Things are getting real creative up in here. Oh, what are those new things called that are in the caves? Oh, what are they called? Uh, spore? Sp uh, no, this is spore blossom. What is it called? They're like super small. Ah, here it is. Glow lichen. Put a couple of glow lichen around. That's a win. Okay. Now let's put a nice tall plant here. Something. Maybe these plants right here. So an azalea. Put a flowering, flowering azalea. Okay. Oh, and then, and then these ones won't be flowering anymore, so we'll switch these out to uh, just normal azalea. Yep, and then once they grow up and start flowering, you transplant them here. Okay. Very cool. Got to put some of the new stuff in. Bone meal. This is fun. This is, this is, a, this is a cool little... Thing. So we've got some drip leaf going on here of different heights. I'm trying to think of what else we need. Small drip leaf? I think small drip leaf can only go in the water. Some lilacs. Actually, here, let's put the lilacs over here. Lily of the Valley. It's always a fun one. Actually, you know what we'll do? I know what we'll do. It's all coming together, guys. It's all coming together. Put that there. Put this here. Slap that down. We'll just have uh, you know, one or two flowers back here. Just behind it. Okay, we've got a cornflower. What else we're we rocking with? Peonies, rose bushes, of course. Maybe a cauldron filled with water. I'm really trying to get like the look to the, the trying to get the look down. Let's see. It looks, okay, it looks like, it doesn't look like a professional greenhouse. It looks like someone's greenhouse in their backyard, which is totally fine. It's totally fine, but that's not necessarily what I was going for. I want to get something going here on the ceiling. I just can't think of what I want. Uh, like for, Like a sprinkler system. There's got to be some... I'm thinking end rods, but that's going to look kind of weird. Um, <laughs> does dripstone like a boss? Wait a minute. Actually, let me look at that stuff. Point at dripstone. Yeah, no, that, that's that's weird. That's not That's not the wave. So we'll have, uh, this is supposed to represent sprinklers, okay? We definitely need some more organic in here. Let's get some moss going. I really want this moss or this carpet somehow. Let's see. Knock out these side blocks. Get just a little bit more green in here. I love the sound effect when you place this block. Oh my god. They did such a good job on this update. Okay. I'm trying to think of what else we might need in here. I'm not gonna lie, that's perfect. That's exactly what it needed. Um... Yeah, no, this is pretty cool.
I like this. I'm happy with this. I think... Oh, they're throwing stuff in the water. I think that these spore blossoms really, really brought it together. Like, so much. I was... I totally forgot about them. I forgot about a lot of, like, the new stuff, because, you know, it's brand new. Can't... It's not, like, in my memory yet. And, uh, yeah, no, that stuff is really cool. Throw down a lot. Oh, you can grow stuff on top of the, the moss block. Did not know that. Let's just put all this stuff down. Heck, why do we got this on this, this ugly grass? Respectfully, of course, respectfully. I like it when they throw stuff in the water, that's pretty cool. <clears throat> yeah, no, this is nice. Maybe we could add... I'm trying to think of one more thing to add. Oh, I got you. Bam. Compost bin. We don't mess around here. Okay, we don't. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Oh, it's because this desk is longer. Okay, yeah. Throw some stuff into there. Grab that one more bush, and then I think we're going to be done. Uh... Is it the lilac? I think it's the rose. But no, it's the lilac. Isn't it? Or is it the peony? It was the peony. Look at that. Okay. And we'll grab a couple of vines. Why not? Yeah, man. When you go in this place, it's definitely going to be very... Uh, you're going to be like, man, it smells like plants. Yeah, so that is going to be it for today's build. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I think it came out pretty well. Pretty greenhouse. What are all these particles around these spore particles? Is is it supposed to do that? I don't I don't I'm not quite sure what the, these spores do. It's kinda dangerous. <laughs> Hopefully they're they're safe spores, you know? Okay. So yeah, that is gonna be it for today's build. Uh hope you guys enjoyed watching it. Don't forget to uh, you know, maybe leave a like, comment, subscribe, whatever you guys want to do. I always appreciate anything you guys do to help, especially comments. I love reading you guys' comments. And uh yeah. I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.